from the CBS Broadcast Center in Los Angeles. This is CBS 2 News This Morning at 6. Good morning, good morning. Today is Friday, October 21st. I just love it. I love that it is too. Friday. I love the way you say it. Yeah, thanks. Welcome to CBS 2 News This Morning at 6 and streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. I'm Marcy Gonzalez. Good morning, everyone. We're starting out with a beautiful sunrise, so that's always nice. I'm Chris Holmstrom. There's a lot going on in your world today. Here's your SoCal Eye Opener. We want the immediate resignation of Gil Cedillo and Kevin DeLeon. The LA City Council meets virtually again today. How protesters are making their voices heard after Kevin DeLeon's apology. Be an advocate for your kids. If you think something's wrong, don't be afraid to call the pediatrician. A warning to parents, hospitals are being flooded with young patients. What you need to know about the uptick in RSV cases. I am very concerned about it and I am doing my part to conserve. Plus another dry winter in SoCal could be a recipe for disaster. The dire effect of the lack of rain to our water supply. And the Clippers face the Lakers at the Crypto.com Arena. We've got the highlights from the Battle of L.A. All right, let's start off with a check of your forecast. we got Alex with a beautiful sunrise and what I want to yes. call a Fall Friday fun day. Oh. Fall Friday fun day. I, I just like thought it. of that. I like it that. It feels <laughs> like fall, right? It does. It, well, it's going to feel even more like fall as we head into this weekend. As you will notice, it a big cool down. So a pattern change, a pattern shift as temperatures will be in the 60s this weekend. But today... Well, we're still going to be close to average, maybe a few degrees above it. Upper 70s across Los Angeles and Orange County this afternoon under a partly cloudy sky inland. We will feel temperatures rise into the uh, upper 80s across our valley hot spot. So looking ahead to the weekend, I know that is what everybody wants to know. What can we expect weather-wise this weekend? Well, Saturday, it's going to be cool and gloomy. It's going to be one of those days you want to just kind of snuggle up on the couch and have some hot chocolate, right? I mean, we'll be under a gray sky. Temperatures in the upper 60s. We could see a little bit of light rain and drizzle as well. More sunshine by Sunday with temperatures in the lower 70s. Chris and Marcy, back to you. I'm assignment editor Mike Rogers at the desk. We're following breaking news this morning in the Florence area. Let's get straight to Sky 2, who just got overhead. This is at 88th and Firestone. During the break, I was able to talk to the uh, Los Angeles County Fire Department. They tell me they were requested by the Sheriff's Department here just before 5 a.m. on a report of a shooting. They were asked to stage by the Sheriff's Department. The sheriffs went in there, made sure the scene was secure. The fire department came in and they transported one person to an area trauma center. We don't know the exact condition of that person, and we don't know if anybody is in custody related to the shooting. I talked to the sheriff's department. They told me they're holding the scene until the detectives can get there to process it and try to gain as much information as they can. But for right now, one person taken to a trauma center after a shooting at 88th and Firestone. Guys? We are so excited. We just can't hide it. CBS mornings are, well, everything your morning should be. Is this a date or will we be just friends? CBS mornings, starting at 7. Get CBS News Los Angeles on the CBS News app. Download now. Got your phone handy? Of course you do. Scan this right here. Download the CBS LA app. And just like that, you're connected to all the best local news and videos. Now, if only everything were this easy.